Yeah. What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. What's going on, people? Let me take these off real quick. Like I said, the good thing about the internet is um, you can do chats, you can do, uh, you can do, hold on a minute here, you can do, uh, meetings, you do all sorts of stuff. That's what I'm going, that's what I just did only 10 minutes ago. I was on a meeting. Like I said, Google Plus, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, all that. It's great. I mean, you can meet. If you, if you don't want to meet, you don't take advantage of this stuff. That's not my fault. It's your fault. You could do the same thing I'm doing. You just got to get off your ass. So, back to lecture at hand. I'm Mr. Warmack. I'm in the building. You know what I do. Then I'm talk about um, our, uh, our uh, Planned Parenthood. Yes. The government extended arm of abortion has been, has received a record of around four, what, well, five? 542, let's say 540 million dollars in taxpayer support in 2012. And this is a steady increase in the funding despite the Republicans leading in the state and federal level to get money taken away from them. Uh, 45% of, 45% of this, like I, I, was, I was researching this and like 45% of their budget comes from the taxpayers. It comes from you and I. Now, to me, this is a disgrace and an embarrassment. And every black person, you should be you should be pissed off at this right now because Planned Parenthood was set in line to get rid of the blacks, Hispanics, Indians, the poor. Look this up, Margaret Sanger. Margaret Sanger, the the, what, the founder or the head of the Planned Parenthood, she met with the Klan when the Klan was in their height. Remember back in the day when. I don't think it was Truman or before, where they were, where they were um, the Great Depression and all that good stuff. They were sleeping in. This is when the shanty town was in the White House. Long was the shanty town. Margaret Sanger, who was the was the head of the Planned Parenthood, met with the Klan. This is when the Klan was at their height. This this is this ain't look, this ain't friend of them drinking drinking you know old Milwaukee. Or, or, you know, Wild Irish Rose and puts a few sheets on her head to say, drops the N-bomb every five minutes. No, this is when the Klan had influence. They had political connects. They had, they had other connects. They had connects, period. And Margaret Sanger met with these people. I don't know what the conversation was because I wasn't there. Chances are I'd been killed if I was there. But uh, what kills me about this, nice segue, by the way, you didn't catch that. What gets me is, Black folks do not don't even recognize this. You, well, you can't talk to them about this. You don't understand Planned Parenthood. If you look at Planned Parenthood, look where all the look where they're at. They're, they're not in the suburbs. Planned Parenthood is is by design and in, in the in the shady parts of your town or or the real low income areas. And of course, they're going to get all that money. You want to know why? It keeps the, everything goes down because they know you're going to name your kids Shaniqua or. Right. You, you, you give them like a 13, you give them 13 letter first names and 36 letter last names, and they don't want they want that no more. They want to keep that shit down. And this what kills me. And like we're we're, we're, we're underwriting the, the abortion business, basically. And you can't say I'm not doing it because it's my part of my taxpayer money going to that too. You know what I mean? I mean it's just it's just to me. We just got to cut federal funding. If Planned Parenthood wants to stay in business, you make it a private entity. And if it is a private entity, stop the money. But 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 this is going to take a lot more than just myself and others to say so. This is going to take other people, yes, black folks, to rise up off their ass and to, then to start looking at this stuff critically and seriously. 
like I said, if Empire goes off the air, you'll be down there complaining of Fox News, which, by the way, y'all made Fox the number one channel in the, in the country, by the way. Good job, black people. More and more, more and more. You never cease to amaze me, but good job. But, uh, they wanted to strip funding the last session of Congress, but the Democrats weren't going to hear about it. Which, by the way, the Democrats like Planned Parenthood, but yet you love the Democrats. And if you guys can't put the dots together, well, never mind. You know, you can't put the dots together. That's why. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's like uh, federal appeals court. They blocked in. They blocked Indiana from carrying out law to cut Medicaid funding to Planned Parenthood. I mean, it's just. This is crazy. I mean, oh my goodness! Like I have, I have notes over here which I was studying off of. You know, they spent the last, and we get to these plan panels asking for more money, and we'll give it to them. But like I said, if you sit down here. I mean, yeah, Planned Parenthood has the arm of where they give you out condoms and they treat STDs, but they're, you know what Planned Parenthood does, it fucking kills kids. But again, then again, most of y'all don't care about your own kids, so why would you care about somebody else's kids, you know? So, I'm out. Peace. Great guy. He's always himself.